I want you to look into my fucking eyes. And I want you to understand how deathly fucking serious I am about this. I want you to notice there's no fucking hat, there's no fucking set, there's no fucking shirt, there's no fucking nothing. This is fucking straight up me. The person who plays me on YouTube. I swear to fucking Christ. You, whoever the fuck, you dox people on my fucking channel, you literally put their name and fucking address on my fucking channel, I report you. I don't give a fuck who you are, I don't give a fuck how long you've been here, I don't give a fuck. You dox somebody on my fucking channel, I immediately report you. I want you to look into my fucking eyes and know that I am deathly fucking serious. You dox somebody on my fucking channel, I report you. I don't give a shit if I said before I'm never going to report anybody. I don't give a fuck what I've said in the past. I don't give a shit if this makes me look like a hypocrite. I don't fucking care. I don't fucking know. Right now, I can't even fucking think straight. I don't give a fuck. You do not dox people on my fucking channel. You put somebody's fucking address on my channel, I report you. Period. And I hope you get fucking removed and banned. And I hope you get fucking, your IP gets fucking tagged somehow or whatever. I hope you have to buy a whole new fucking PC to be able to get on fucking YouTube again. Fuck you and your ass. Your shit's illegal. You're a fucking piece of shit. You should be fucking ashamed of yourself. Don't ever fucking dox people on my fucking channel. Or I will report you. Alright, class. Gather around. Um, straight talk only here, right? Now, I got this guy in the comments, and he name dropped. Vouch. Right? And, I, I've always told you guys that when you name drop me in other people's comments, you are representing me. I don't care if you do it. Most likely I'll never find out if you do. But, one way I will find out if you do is somebody someday might get in contact with me and say, this is a screen cap of what one of your people put on my video. You know what I mean? So, be righteous. This is it, right? If you're going to represent me, be righteous close as you possibly can be. Never intentionally lie on my behalf. And don't, if you don't think you really know my viewpoints, if there's any doubt in your mind that you might rep misrepresent me in some way, just don't do it. Just leave well enough alone. Throw out your own thoughts. Don't, don't bring me into this shit, right? Because, you know, there's people like me out there. So he drops this name, Bosch. And I thought this guy was himself kind of... <laughs> so, I don't, I don't want to fight students. I want to fight masters. Right? I don't want to fight the goofballs that these idiots pump out. I want to fight the idiots themselves. And see how good their game is. Now, I've watched a couple of Bosch videos. I recorded his critique of the debate. I was going to critique his critique of the debate. I don't want to. Because it it's nonsensical. It's It doesn't go anywhere. It's all his feelings and it's what he thinks. And it's nothing. He says, I think this. And then he throws out a whole bunch of facts and goes... And everybody goes, whoa, he's so smart. Look at all those facts. And what you don't understand is that he didn't really say anything. Like, he didn't say anything. And... The, his critique of the fucking debate is utter fucking trite. Like, this dude's a Twitch star. I, I'm watching his video, he's got the fucking stupid ass fucking chat crawling on the whole side of the fucking screen. He's got a dumb fucking lizard that pops up whenever somebody wants him to say something. I, I don't fuck, it, it's It's obnoxious. It's so childlike. And that's who he has watching him. He's a Twitch streamer. He's talking to kids. 
So, he dices up his Twitch stream and then uploads it to YouTube, and it's fucking awful. It's just utter fucking tripe. It's, it's, it's for kids. Like, it's for kids. It's brainwashing for kids. And it's pitiful. And he's sad. And I don't respect him. And I don't give a fuck about him. And I really wish that I would have just goofed on this fucking commenter and not bothered ever even looking into Vosh because I don't I don't want to talk about this guy he's as far as I am concerned he's the Anision of politics on YouTube he does the exact same shit that Anision does I watched him debate Tim I watched it for what a half an hour and I couldn't fucking take it anymore I was ready to jump off my balcony it was so utterly fucking nonsensical and pointless. And that's exactly what all of his fucking videos are. So if I'm, I'm putting this out to the class, show of hands, everybody, and I will be counting. So this vote does matter. So, and, and this shit has happened in the past. There has been a time where somebody won a piece of my handmade artwork and literally handmade. I cut the wood myself I fucking sanded the wood myself, I painted on the wood myself, I did the whole fucking process myself by hand. Well, obviously I didn't process the wood, I went and bought it at the store. They cut it into big sections, I cut it into smaller sections and then sanded it and the whole fucking thing, did the whole project from there. Nevertheless, I made the whole fucking thing by my hands. A lot of people would love to have that, I imagine. And I did an art contest for it. One dude put in an entry. And it was a picture of my heating pad saying something. It was literally a blue square with a white cord off of it and a yellow voice box with some text in it. And he won. Because he was the only one that entered. I've actually had that twice, I think. Somebody else made me like just a god-awful picture of like me and my fuck doll that I don't have anymore by the way and uh... the heating pad was there too I think he won art too or maybe I got them mixed up, I don't remember Somebody put in an, the only entry, and it was the one that won because it was my only fucking entry. So if one person votes, that person just decides that you're going to see me fucking have to sit through a fucking 18 minute long nonsensical video tomorrow or not. Or we move on to different stuff. And by the way, everybody that's like, ugh, because people have learned the cycle at this point because I call it out every fucking time it happens. It's usually always three. These videos always come in threes, right? So you're not going to get a third one. Like, this dude, he would, like, he's so arrogant and unlikable just in his comments. I won't even entertain another comment from him. Really, the only reason I posted it, because I love the dig of you're not fucking hired. Like, that shit made me laugh. Um, so, really, it was the only reason I posted it. But a lot of people, the, the feedback is, it's pretty much uniform. Like, everybody that's commenting on the video right now is like, so, essentially, you just uploaded the same video two days in a row. And I'm like, yeah, I did. And then somebody said, I know that there's going to be another fucking video talking about what you... And I'm like, no. I'm like, honestly, no. <laughs> like, if people are telling me, dude, you literally uploaded two videos in a row, honestly, I'm not even going to give him the chance to give me the same fucking thing again reworded so that I do the same video again a second time and not even fucking catch it myself because it was reworded so deftly as to just be stupid points that I just wanted to be like what the fuck so yeah no there will be no third video on that asshole tomorrow we move we move on or, or, or we do Vosh uh, I personally my vote is not Vosh but I am throwing myself on the will of you people. I am going to allow you to decide. Like I said, I will literally be counting votes. I will be isolating just this video. 
This is like essentially a contest at this point. I will be isolating out just this video. I will be making hash marks on a piece of paper. I will be totaling up yeses and noes. So put in your vote. Do you want me to bother to go down the Vosh road for literally one fucking video? I will do one fucking video. And honestly, if everybody comes back with a yes, I'm going to throw out another video and be like, give me a link for one because I don't even care. And I'll sit through it and talk about it and fucking whatever. And if and I swear to Christ, you send me one of his fucking hour and a half, two hour long fucking streams, I'm going to cut ten minutes out of it and I'm going to talk about that and that's what you get. All right? So give me something realistic and reasonable if we get to that point. But he still has to fucking win the yes. He still has to win you guys over. And if you need to fucking watch him to figure out if you want to even see me talk about him, his name is Vosh, V-A-U-S-H, I think, something like that. And, and... <laughs> like, the dude's very soy looking. I'll throw out an insult that he's going to probably like react to or something or whatever because it sounds like an insult that he would use. I don't stoop low enough to give a fuck about your pop modern fucking insults for each other, so I don't care. But yeah, he's very soy looking. That was kind of the first thought I had in my mind. I'm like, people would call him a soy boy. <laughs> so, be prepared for that fucking shit. But yeah, just let me know if you really fucking want me to do it, but I really don't want to. Because I think, honestly, you guys got the fucking Tim Pool shit show to watch. Please just tell me that that was good enough and I don't actually have to watch one of this dude's fucking videos. But bear in mind, if you say yes, I'm going to make you pick it. Because I don't... I'm not going to look for a good one. I can't watch any more of this dude. I've watched, at this point, a full hour of him and I cannot fucking stand it. So, there's where we are. And I'm not going to stay up and interact. I'm, I'm going to stay up and do this video and interact with the Tim Pool video because I want to because it's fun. But I'm not going to be interacting with this video tonight. I'm going to just wait in the morning. And when I get home from work at probably 4 o'clock in the afternoon. So it'll be, it's almost 11 o'clock now. So we're looking at, uh... 17 hours? You guys have 17 hours. Go! Not even that, because I still have to edit it and shit. Go! <laughs>